Welcome back, Vagabonds. I am here in uh, Würzburg and gonna be exploring the city. Started off in Nuremberg, took the train up here, the regional train, and just kind of checking things out, see what's interesting here during uh, the winter months. Uh, one of the things that I like to do is to kind of have a uh, place that's a spoke when I'm traveling and then go out to different areas that are nearby um, from there. So it's kind of going to Bamberg, um, Forsberg here. I was wanting to go to Munich, but I'm not going to be able to do that because of the blizzard that's gone on. But uh, yeah, so I started my morning with a coffee and a cinnamon roll, but let's uh, go ahead and check things out. So I'm in the process of walking up here to the Sodlicker Hof Keller house, residence, sorry. Uh, not really good with the German pronunciation, so I apologize for my poor pronunciation. I'm uh, right below the residence here and have all these grapevines that will be producing grapes in the spring, summer, you can see uh, Wurzburg in the background here. Uh, you can also see probably here. I uh, probably scared them off. Uh, you might see, there's one. There's a bunch of crows behind me up by the, the grapevine. So it's kind of kind of a neat little spot here. And uh, yeah, if you are wanting to come up here and are wanting to walk also, prepare to take about an hour to get up here. Probably take a 45, 50 minutes to get back. It's downhill. It's a slight upgrade back to the train station. But yeah, it's a nice little walk today. Um, gonna get my steps in and check this out.
All right, that was a nice hike up here. This is actually a fortress up here also. Uh, there's a museum. Unfortunately, I came here on a Monday, so it was closed, the museum was, but uh, there's some art here. And it's definitely worth your time to come up here. Got great views, as you can see. And uh, yeah, so I have gotten a lot of energy out of me, so I need to replenish that. So I'm thinking about going to get some food. So let's find uh, some traditional food that uh, can be found here in Würzburg. So, had myself a bratwurst, some sauerkraut, some potatoes. They were quite delicious, quite uh, generic uh, German food there. And uh, ended up having some mousse, chocolate mousse with uh, fresh fruit. It was quite delicious. But uh, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave you here. Hope you enjoyed this. Hope you got to learn something new about this area. And uh, anyway, if you did uh, like this, hit the like button, hit the uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And uh, until then, I'll see you on the next one. Alright, one thing that I will say as I'm uh, heading here, just last thoughts, I'm walking to the train station, but the little Christmas markets here are pretty cute. They're kind of ornate with the setups. So if you're thinking about going to Christmas market, you might want to come out here to uh, Horsburg. It's uh, pretty. And hearing that xylophone in the background is pretty cool too.